horrible human being. He's got a first class ticket to hell. Why am I supposed to feel bad? Why am I supposed to not speak poorly of the dead? Caitlyn Jenner tweeted, very tacky, very distasteful. Basically what it said was good riddance. No matter what you think of someone, Ocho, you don't celebrate someone's death. If I'm not mistaken, brother, I mean, sister, sister, brother, Caitlyn Jenner also mm -hmm. had an issue. 2015, fatal car accident, kill somebody. That at the hands of Caitlyn Jenner, mm -hmm. someone lost their life. Mm -hmm. So yes, how would she feel? Now she did she I don't if I'm not mistaken I don't recall her spending any not one day in jail but you yeah. you you say good riddance you happy yeah. for the death you know God don't like my grandma used to always say when I was a little boy Ocho mm -hmm. God don't like ugly no. sometimes he don't like pretty you, you better never be know. careful Doug Gottlieb reacts to Shannon Sharp's comments on OJ Simpson passing I want you to hear exactly what Doug had to say and then I'll play Shannon Sharp's comments and then I'll give my full reaction Did you hear what Shannon Sharp said he's like Listen, um, never wish ill upon the dead, right? Shannon Sharp and Chad Johnson both saying, never wish ill upon the dead when O.J. Simpson died. You're not allowed to wish ill upon the dead when he's responsible for the deaths of two people, including his ex-wife? No, 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 no. I don't, I don't, I'm not the bad guy for not mourning the loss of the bad guy. Sorry, right? And this is not like sports guy. This is not, you know, Barry Bonds who took steroids. That's the only way he could pass uh, Henry Aaron's record. This is not even Alex Rodriguez, like the shadiest, worst dude ever. Like, no, this is a completely different level. We talk about sports and business. Like, I, the, the murderers, I think, we, you got a special place in hell there, right? It's, it's more than just being responsible for, and I believe, though found innocent in a criminal court of law, I believe he did it. There's the interview. I, I mean, you guys have all seen the interview, right, where he went through the imaginary scenario you know, if in in this uh, in this scenario and then all of a sudden you can see him walking you through that night and he's got this nefarious Charlie figure. Dude's a sociopath. Like, what are we all doing when Charlie Manson died? Did you have to go like, you know, hey, listen, I'll do respect to the passing of the Charlie Manson. You murder somebody or responsible for or no, the 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 softest I could ever go is, well, at least he what knows who did it. And for all of this time, for the 30 years since the passing of his ex-wife, he couldn't give her family peace. And so now he dies. We're supposed to go like, hey, you know, he died. Like, never speak ill upon the dead. No! He's a horrible human being. He's got a first-class ticket to hell. Why am I supposed to feel bad? Why am I supposed to not speak poorly of the dead? My, I'm, you're a God-fearing Christian man. Uh, Dan, am I wrong here? Am I, am I the bad guy for saying that? No, I don't think that you're the bad guy. I think that there are a lot of people that, that share your opinion on this. I do not share the opinion of Shannon Sharp. I also think that Shannon Sharp, because he attacked Caitlyn Jenner. Uh, oh, that's what it was. It was about, it was about yeah, Caitlyn Jenner. Yes, that's where it ended up. Because she made a, a, a comment on Twitter. And so I think that's where X, wherever it was. That's where I think that it was angled. Caitlyn Jenner tweeted, very tacky, very distasteful. Yes. Basically, what it said was good riddance. No matter what you think of someone, Ocho, you don't celebrate someone's death. You, you never do that. You never do you that. Never you know, do. It's, one, it's one thing about God. God don't play. You don't celebrate nobody's death. Even if you despise that person based on personal issues y'all might have gone through. Now, you have to remember. Now, OJ, the case, he was acquitted, but obviously acquitted. He was tried in the, in, uh, in the civil case. Mm -hmm. Now, also, again, God don't like ugly. If I'm not mistaken, brother, I mean, sister, sister, brother, Caitlyn Jenner. Also had an issue. 2015, fatal car accident. Kill somebody. Wow. No, hold on. Wait, hold on. Hold on. Hold on. No, no hey. you didn't. Yeah, no, she didn't. Now, everything in the OJ, we, people allegedly, he mm -hmm. killed Nicole Brown Simpson yeah. yes, sir. and Ronald Goldman. Yes, sir. He went on trial. Mm -hmm. 12 men and women. Mm -hmm. A jury of his peers mm -hmm. says, we don't believe he did it. Yes, sir. Beyond a reasonable doubt. Right. They acquitted him. He went to trial on the civil charges. He was convicted. So you mean to tell me there's no denying that at the hands of Caitlyn Jenner, mm -hmm. someone lost their life? Mm, yes, so sir. how would she feel? Now, she did she, I don't, if I'm not mistaken, I don't recall her spending any, not one day in jail. But you, yeah. you, you say good riddance. You happy yeah. for the death. You know, God don't like, my grandma used to always say when I was a little boy, Ocho, mm -hmm. God don't like ugly. No. Sometimes he don't like pretty. You, and you better never be know, careful. You, you got to be careful because you never know. You never know your time is up. Every time we're born, we all come with an expiration date. Now, we Absolutely. don't know what that day is, but what you don't want to do is you don't want to speed it up because the tongue is yeah. powerful. If There's you're going to celebrate somebody else, listen, if you're going to celebrate somebody else's death, 
Now you got to be careful. And God, God, God can show you better than he can tell you. Yes, absolutely. See, people, a lot of times, Ocho, people say, well, it, now they can have peace. There is no peace. No, nah, it would never be. I no don't peace. get to have peace. I, I, it, I've been without peace. my loved ones uh, uh, for 30 years. I don't get yeah. peace. Yeah. You can't you. break. Someone nope. dying doesn't mm-hmm. give me peace because nah. my loved one is still gone. gone. Now, yeah. if that person went away and then my loved one came back, now nah, I get to have peace, Ocho. Peace. Yeah. I don't get yeah. no peace out peace. of this. Yeah. And again, and that that's a sign, even if you don't say anything, that's a sign of actually celebrating death and feeling like, OK, now I'm at peace because the yeah. individual that that might be responsible for this incident is finally gone right. and resting in, in, in heaven or wherever it may be. But right. again, people that's watching people in the chat, you've got to be careful because the tongue is very, 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 very powerful, very yeah. powerful. Don't wish no ill will on nobody, especially once they transition. What he allegedly did ain't no defense. I, we're not Ocho and I. We ain't offering no defense for yeah, my last. My we're, last name ain't my last name ain't Cochran. No, no, uh-huh. or Jerry Spence, or any mm-hmm. of these big time lawyers. Mm-hmm. That ain't what we do. We were talking about the man, the football player that succumbed to his battle with cancer. That's yeah. what we're doing. So don't. Oh, uh, oh, nightcap. Uncle and Ocho was defending. Ain't nobody defending anything. No, no. Don't don't even go out there and take that out there. And, and you you don't offer it. There's nothing to defend. What we were all upset about, what I was upset about, you can speak to yourself, is that what Caitlyn Jenner said, good riddance, is in celebrating the death of someone. Okay, don't do that. that that's what Ocho and I, I mean, had don't she not said what she said, we would have never mentioned her name. And then we could have just talked about OJA. He was a, a tremendous football player. Mm-hmm. The credits that he had in acting. Right. Um, um, naked gun. Most people know him for naked gun. Uh, Bro, he's uh, so funny. The one he way. had with Elizabeth Montgomery. We would have just talked about that, but we had to bring her in it mm-hmm. because she inserted herself in it because she thought it was cute. Right. Knowing did she realize that she took a man's life? So first with Doug, he's standing on business. He's letting it be known. Like, why should I feel sorry for someone I think did a crime or it looks like he did the crime of getting rid of his ex-wife and Goldman. So he feels as though, look, regardless of what the juries and the court of law said that OJ was acquitted, innocent of those charges, he feels as though in his heart that OJ did it. A lot of the comments OJ made after the fact, kind of alluding to it, maybe joking around with it. He feels as though OJ Simpson is a bad person and why should I have to mourn a bad individual? It's just like the Manson dude or anyone else that did some crazy evil stuff. Should I mourn their loss? I guess he's putting OJ Simpson in that box. Like, look, he's a bad person and that's his energy with OJ. I feel where Doug is coming from to the simple fact like, look, I'm not going to feel sorry for someone I think did, you know, a terrible thing to his ex-wife. And that other individual, Goldman, I feel the same way with certain things as well. It's like, look, it could be some crazy person out there that eliminated other individuals. Am I supposed to mourn their loss? You know, it is what it is with them. As far as what Shannon Sharp was saying, Caitlyn Jenner's comments may have been a little extra celebrating the passing of OJ. He feels as though, like, why are we celebrating, you know, the downfall of someone as far as them passing on? He feels as though karma is real. Same thing with Ocho said as well in that clip. And again, I understand both parts of it. Not trying to play both sides, but some people, they don't, you know, celebrate or they may handle someone's passing differently regardless of what they did. They'll let the ultimate maker handle them in the afterlife if that's what you believe in. So some people are going to feel as though whatever happens to OJ, who cares? Other people are like, you know, we're not going to celebrate the passing. But at the end of the day, I'm not going to feel sorry for him if he does pass. So again, it's really, you know, how everyone wants to handle the situation. Again, I had no emotional ties to OJ. I'm not celebrating the loss, but I'm not sad or, you know, crying about it. You know, it is what it is. You know, he passed away. Condolences to the family he did have children and you know i'm not gonna knock anybody for feeling how they feel about you know the passing of oj if someone wants to say good riddance it is what it is if if someone wants to say you know let's not speak ill of the dead i respect that as well it is what it is man you know everybody got to feel how they feel but like subscribe comment what do you think about Doug Gottlieb's reaction to the OJ passing? And what do you think about Shannon Sharp's reaction to Caitlyn Jenner's comments on OJ Simpson's passing? I want to know your thoughts about this. Like, subscribe, comment. Appreciate y'all watching the video. Peace.